Oh, B2. Um, before we do that... Wait, wait, wait a sec. Before we do that, I want to go back and grab that treasure. Treasure number one, which is all the way back there. All the way back in the upper... The upper right. We don't want any more failures like last time when you tried to make her sneeze insensibly. That was your fault, Nana and Saki, when you put in Hermione's food by mistake, right? Well, it can't, ha it can't happen to anyone. Anyway, this is the demise of that young woman, right? Ho oh, ho. You guys are evil. You guys are gonna poison Lean? My goodness. Talk about evil. Oh, I fell. Talk about evil sergeants. Favorite sergeant? Easily Mio. That's it, right? Yeah. What was that treasure I just got? I wasn't paying attention. Oh, it was a rune ring. Plus one defense slows IP loss. I could give that to... Honestly, it's not really worth it. I got it. But not really worth it. Now I believe we can... I think the money respawns if you leave a screen, right? Is that how it works? Oh, oh no, it responds when you leave the area as a whole. Okay, that's fine. Alright, so yeah, when you leave the area as a whole. So, uh, that's fine. We don't need to really look for money. I didn't do battles, but why not just heal? Alright, B2 is up next. There's a dungeon scope right there. See a chest over there. I also see money first. I want to make sure you grab the money, as always. Then there's another dungeon scope. I don't know if this bridge will open now. It, oh, it's nice. It's it's a little bouncer. Beautiful old armor. That's good for Justin, I think. Yeah. It's for Sue, too, but I'd rather give it to Justin. And you ben you can't benefit from that. Alright. Uh, once I get to a stashing place, I'm going to, uh... What am I thinking? I'm going to, uh... Drop the- drop the adventure robe. Uh, puffy kick. I gotta show off Rob Ra at some point. There'll be a chance to show it off. I don't really need- I'm not really needing it yet. I haven't really been low on health. It is a good healing thing to have. Alright, I think we're gonna just have Justin attack now. Since Sue and Justin should be tied in weapon XP. Plus, I believe... I know weapon XP has like a level scaling system. Where the higher level you are... No, the lower level your weapon is and however level- whatever level the enemies are. If the enemies like over level your weapon levels or something then you're gonna get levels really fast. So if my if my sword is like level one, for example, and I'm at the end of the game, it'll go really fast. So it does make it easier in that sense. All right, I lost myself. Except not really. I believe. We have a couple of other treasures to find. Use this. Alright, there's something up the stairs. Get that first. Oh, hey. Easy. Oh, it fell. I wanted to come down here anyway. That's a Rezo potion. Which will revive an ally. On the fight the slimes, because the slimes are very good for XP. IMO. Also, I don't think these are the ones that can divide. Or these probably... No, these can divide, I think. But obviously, we're killing them so fast, so they're not dividing all that much. Alright, Justin, you can finish off. Yeah, you do this, and then we'll have Sue attack the other ones. Yeah, Justin can weaken that one. Perfect. How much SP do you have? 20? You could puffy kick this one. Yeah, puffy kick that one, and Justin will weaken that one. Let's go 
All right, good, good damage. Uh, Sue, get the attack. Come on, Justin, quick! Thank you, critical. There we go. All flawless right, victory, won. except not really flawless because I did take damage. Flawless victories where you don't take damage and win. Uh, we got the Rezo Potion, so what other treasures am I missing? Oh, hey. Oh, you caught me. Oh, part of my plan, I wanted you to get ambushed. Uh, I might be at six. What was the Rezo Potion? Was that, tre was that treasure number four? Six. Rezo Potion was six. Okay, so we're, uh, we're farther than I thought. Oh, no, not Sonar. These bats can be dangerous. Oh, thank goodness it was only two damage. Oh, they died when hit, though. The Sonar thing could be dangerous if they spam it, though. Sue, how are you not killing with a mace? I'm, I'm surprised. Probably because mace gives you HP and wit and not strength? I don't know. Or Sue just has lower base attack than Justin. Which is definitely possible. Alright. Let me use this to kind of reorient myself. I'm right near the res where I got the Rezo Potion. Which means I need to go back. See some treasure up there. I can't go there though until I elevate myself. I will fight these guys. Get him, Sue. Face slash. Sue is the best call to beat the bats. I'm shocked she's not killing the bats one hit. You know, it'd be that way sometimes. Yeah, I'm Justin. And their soul. Thank you. Ow, that hurts. Don't hit my little girl. Sue is very fragile. Please don't hit her. I'm gonna let Sue get this kill. Nice, nice. Bum, 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 bum. All right. Let's find a way up there. Oh, there's slimes up there. Alright, I need to find a way back to, like, the previous area so I can get more treasures. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, hey. Can that be used? No, I have to use that from upper somewhere. What if... Oh, there's stairs here. Perfect. I did not realize that. In that case, there's a bridge there, but I don't want that. I want to just go... Oh, there's stairs there. Perfect. All right, I'm going to skip these brain bats for now. No, these aren't brain bats. Brain bats are later in the Tower of Temptation. These are just bats. All right, so let's rethink this. I got treasure number three, which was... I don't remember what it was, but I definitely got treasure number three, and I got treasure number six. So we're missing four and five. I got this gold apparently too. All right. So I need. Oh, I, I actually think I'm good on treasure. Okay, I understand now. I just wanted a better bird eyes view. So we should get the gold all the way on the right if I can. First. I can find the way up there. Oh, I think I see it. I can go all the way south here. The game doesn't let me know. Never mind, it does not let me go there. I think. Hang on, hang on. Need to better position myself. Let's just get the gold that's across the bridge to make my life easier. And just, I could say I got it. Could fall this way, though. 
Yeah, I could do this, and then we'll, gri we'll grab treasure five now. Oh, it's an axe! I mean, at least we have an axe now. Oh, hey, that fell. I didn't realize I was gonna fall. That fell. We're missing treasure four then. Which we somehow have to grab. Trying to see if we miss anything. Does not look like it. Okay. Yeah, we're just missing treasure four. And the other piece of gold I didn't grab. Which we somehow had to get. So once we find the way to treasure four, then we can find our way to gold. And then we're done. We got all the treasure at that point. So basically, essentially, getting treasure four and getting the last piece of gold is all we need. That's ideally the same thing, because one leads to the other. Which I think we're good now, because we're on the other side, so it should be easy to get there. Joy-Cons, please! I'm begging you, if I have to do a three-hour stream, that's fine, but like, I'm begging you at least two- We're at like a- we're at like what? Two- Not even two hours and twenty minutes yet, like at least make it until- at least make it until three hours. That's all I'm asking. Oh, hey, that's the treasure four. And then the gold is here, too. Oh, it's a dynamite. Dynamite's actually a pretty good item to use. Let's see, we got treasure one. Did we get all the treasures? Double check. Got the rune, shoot, rune ring. Got the shining shoes. Armor. The old armor, which is the outdated armor. Got the dynamite. Got the rock axe and got the resurrect potion. I forgot that the I forgot that they were limited on characters because this game is a Sega Saturn game originally, so they're they were limited on. Uh, I wanted to get ambushed. They're limited on characters and letters, so they had to shorten the names. So the ceremonial rock axe is actually the rock axe, and the old armor is the outdated armor. But they were limited on characters, so they had to uh, they had to work with what they had. Show off the raw raw. It's time. Sue the cheerleader, here she comes. I love that animation. Never gets old. Ooh, level up mace, nice. Joy-Cons, please! I'm begging you, just... Like, work with me here, Joy-Cons. If only I was smart enough to realize, hey, I haven't used my Switch and it hasn't been connected in so long, it's probably dead. Like, for some reason, past me didn't realize that. Probably should have hit the one that was dying, but... I'm an idiot. What can I say? That's fine. He gets to live a little longer. And potentially divide. He's not dividing, though. Just kill him. Goodbye. All right, we won! Bum bum. I'm kind of curious where my weapon levels are at. Level 4 for sword. Not bad for sword. Axe is level 5. Again, we gotta work on mace. I'd rather work on mace later though because Sue is using the mace. So 700 gold is good. I'd say at least. Oh, we're gonna get more gold though. We're gonna get 30 gold which will basically give us almost 800. Do I have enough SP for a puffy kick? Very unfortunate, but I'll live with it. Oh, you killed! Finally! Pretty easy. She can kill the slimes in two hits now. Good for Sue. She's best girl until actual best girl gets here. Which is pretty soon. We might not get to best girl today, but uh... She is still very soon. We'll get to her next stream. Alright, <laughs> that, that happened. Um, I think we're good. I think we got all the treasure. So we're good to move on. I'm gonna fight these bats, actually. Since I got all the treasure. Do a quick battle.
Oh my goodness, that's a lot of bats. I also know when you get area of effect attacks, when you get AoE attacks, you can just hit a bundle of enemies and uh, it's good for leveling up weapons. So right now, weapons leveling up is very simplistic. It's going to get a lot quicker later when we get AoE moves. So, you know. I know specifically Justin's shockwave attack hits like a pretty big area. Like in that scenario, if we shockwaved all of those bats, we would have got a ton of XP. Same for magic. Alright, we're good to move on, I think. Oh, save point. Huh, nothing happens. It's quite suspicious, though. Very unnatural to be just a statue. I think it's best to report to her Mullen. Huh, I think you're right. Let's go. How on earth did they hide? How on earth did that soldier not see them hide there? <laughs> oh, video game logic. That was close. If we didn't hide so quick, we would have been busted. Hey, you're telling me. Recover? Read the hint just because I can. Weapon skills. This could be our this could be the tutorial for anyone who hasn't played the game. Each character can equip different weapons. For example, Justin can use a sword, mace, or axe. Sue can use a mace or a bow. Each weapon skill has separate experience values. If you use a sword exclusively, your mace will lo level will not increase. When your weapon skill level goes up, one of your basic parameters goes up. For example, sword raises wit and mace raises your max HP parameters. Look under skill in the command window to see which, which parameters increased. Good lesson. Even though I basically explained that, but why not have the game do what it's meant to do? Explain stuff. I love that Grandia has hints in its save points. Something that older games can benefit for. I'm looking straight at Legend of Mana. This must be the statue those soldiers were talking about. It does look suspicious. Justin, what was that? Justin, your bottom is shining. It's my pocket. Could it be the spirit stone inside? The spirit stone is... I've never seen this before. Wow, is it hot? Justin. Something like that has to produce heat. What? Ah, oh, there goes the door. Open sesame, except we didn't need the words. It just opened. I also think the ancient passageway doesn't have treasure. So this door was a this statue was a door. Seems like we can go further on. Why are they open? Was it the light of the spirit stone? That's gotta be it, Sue. The spirit stone is related to the Angelo civilization. That's it. This must be a real spirit stone. <laughs> cool word, the first one's here. Even the guys in Garlisle haven't come in here. Oh, Garlisle Forces. Justin and Sue, Garlisle Forces 1. <laughs> I need to think of a better name to call Justin and Sue. How about the Adventure Duo? The Adventure Duo won. They have won one match between the Garlisle forces. Yeah, there's no treasure here. This is a very linear room, by the way. I believe do this. Oh, do I have to manually press it? No, this isn't the right way. I think we go the I think it's the left one. Up, 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 up. What's this? Oh no, we have to press the green thing first. I don't remember if you actually have to wait for it. No, you do have to wait for it. Oh, uh, game? I'm in through. This ought to be the right way. Oh, hey! Don't mind me, just passing through. Thank you for your hospitality. Who I've never seen a- I've never heard of ruins like this. It moves by itself. I'm sure great discoveries of the Angel of Civilization lie ahead. Right, Sue? Justin, the spirit stone is shining again. Oh no, are we being attacked? Are the statues gonna be living? They're living corpses of the dead. Here to take our souls. Wow, open sesame is a common thing. 
All you do is say open sesame in the world of Grandia and things open. Sue, look, Angelo was calling. Angelo, we're coming. Don't mind us.